um, tips on addressing envelopes and fun ways to dress them up. Um, number one fun way for me and super inexpensive is washi tape. I love washi tape. I collect it. I have hundreds of, of rolls of it. Washi tape is a low tack single sided tape. So it's tacky on one side and printed very thin paper on the other side. You can tear it, you can cut it, you can do a lot of different things with it, but one of the frustrations that new users have is that, you know, you it looks and feels like tape or a sticker, but it is very, very low tack. And so this is easy, can easily be, get caught on things. See how it's like rubbing here? And the edges can get easily lifted and then caught on something and then rip like that. And even rip a little bit of the paper as it did there. So I want to show you a way to avoid that problem. Um, and that is to use this magical solution right here is really, it's just a sealer. Now, if you have a sealer like um, Mod Podge, that would work just fine. This is just a handy thing to keep at your desk because it's so tiny and small and you only need a drop or two. So this is a multi -medi medium in matte. I like the matte finish because um, it, if you got too much, it will not show in the light. It doesn't, it's not glossy at all. So let me show you how to use that. And while I do that, I'm going to show you a trick for tearing washi. So you saw before I just tore it, but if you prefer a really straight edge, one thing you can do is put it on your project to the length that you want it. This is also really great for people that use it in planners. Put down a ruler and then tear it against the ruler and then you'll have a nice straight edge. I'm not worried about putting this on my desk because it is so low tack. Okay, so let's put some on an envelope. And we'll do that ruler trick again. So I have a straight edge. The reason you might not like to use it on your scissors is just because the tackiness can get gummy on your scissors. Um, not by much, it's, it's easy to use anyway, but this just makes it a little bit cleaner and we have nice straight edges. And then to use this to make sure that this tape stays where I put it, I am going to put just a small amount of this multi matte medium on the sticker or on the washi itself and then you just use your finger and rub it all over the entire surface and make sure to get the edges. It will look a little shiny while it's wet, there we go, but as soon as it's dry it will not take long at all. It will be, uh, it seals your washi down and your washi won't peel or lift off. And it's totally washable, I can wash my fingers easily. Okay, so that's one tip I wanted to show you. Another one, if you like to decorate your envelopes, uh, maybe you want to stamp them or you want to use some fun pens to color on them from this stamp set here. You make me happy. So I already have that on this block. And we'll use some nice bright pink ink. And we can stamp that wherever we want on here. Now, the problem with stamping with any kind of ink is that most inks are not water resistant or waterproof. Let me show you what I mean. So here's an ink, and I talked before about maybe you want to use some fun, maybe you want to address an, um, your envelope. And maybe you want to use, you know, some other colors and stuff, whatever you want to do. We all know somebody who needs some love, right? Even the Karens. <laughs> um, if you don't protect this, what can happen is if it gets wet, the colors can run. And that's just a big mess, right? And when I stamped on the back, I didn't protect that either, so those colors can run. See my pink ink is running? So a way that you can protect that is this beauty. This is my second tip here for you guys, Distress Glaze. This is micro glaze actually. So it's just this little teeny vat of what kind of feels like chapstick or um, Vaseline kind of. You just get a small amount on your finger and rub it over the top. See, for both of these tools, I'm just using my finger, no fancy tools. OK, 
Okay, you just rub it over the top, and what that does is it puts down a protective barrier. So now if I get this one wet, see how it bubbles up, the water beads up, and it just resists having, so the ink is protected and it will not run. So even if I address this to Karen again, And even if I want to dress, you know, give it some color. If I protect it with some of this glaze, then when I, it doesn't run. Now I gotta let that envelope dry because <laughs> I got it all wet. But that those are my two fun tips for you. Uh, multi matte medium for sealing washi or if you like to put stickers on the back of your envelopes or on the front or anywhere where they might be a, um, exposed. The multi matte medium will just help seal your stickers down. And then the distress glaze, anything that's going to be um, exposed to moisture, this will help protect it from help your inks or your pins from keep them from running. I hope you send somebody some happy mail soon. <laughs>